What's up, YouTube, 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 YouTube? Excuse my lip. I, I, I was not eating pussy. I'm going to tell you right now, because I know y'all motherfuckers, y'all finna start with me. Motherfuckers already started with me on my live, my Facebook page and shit. I was not eating pussy. Let's get that clear. <laughs> I had an allergic reaction from this my blood pressure medicine I was taking. But anyway, um, I just wanted to share a really embarrassing but true story with you guys. I mean, it's good. Mm. Good ass fucking ice cream. Fucking taco banana shit. Man, this got to be the best fucking ice cream I ever had in my life. But anyway, <clears throat> I'm just eating that shit to have my lip go down. But anyway, I'm going to tell y'all about this motherfucker right here. And how it almost, it, it, it could have killed my ass. Okay, now, this gun here, no safety on it. There's no safety on it at all. So, if you keep one in the head, you gotta be very careful with not pulling this trigger. I keep one in the head, cause I don't wanna try to prepare myself for whatever's coming to me. I wanna be ready for what's coming. That's why people say that. That's why people say I keep one in the head. You know what I'm saying? That's exactly why. So they don't have to prepare themselves to put one in the head. They, they ain't got a cock back. They already ready. Boom, boom, boom. You know what I'm saying? So one day, I was switching, switching bullets and shit. You know what I'm saying? I got fullies and hollows and shit. I was switching bullets to see how, you know what I'm saying, how it jump out. The difference of how they jump out or whatever other, other gun. And uh, me forgetting, I, I forgot I had one in the head. And I was cocking back, cocking back, cocking back. You know what I'm saying? So many times, you know what I'm saying? But I didn't empty the clip. I had forgot that I had one still in the head. So I, I, I dumped the clip out, pulled the clip out of the gun. The bullet was still in the head. Now, normally, when I when I pull the clip out, I point that motherfucker towards the ground. Or, sometimes, I do dumb ass shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, putting the motherfucker to my head and shit, pulling the trigger and shit, just because I know I ain't shit in the motherfucking head, right? But there was still one in my fucking head this time, man. And just so happened... Instead of me doing that dumb shit, playing with the motherfucker, I was pointing at the ground. And I was I was about to clear the motherfucker and wait on that, that snap. You know what I'm saying? Make wait on the click like click. You know what I'm saying? It make the click sound and shit when it ain't got nothing in the head. Man, I pulled that trigger while the gun was still pointing at the ground. And wow! I'm talking about my now my mind you, my dad's in the other room. <laughs> This early, it's early in the morning. I had just came back from the store and shit, and I was on, you know what I'm saying, switching bullets over and all that shit. It's early in the motherfucking morning when this shit happened. And this shit, I'm talking about, it was loud. It was so loud, it rang my ears because it was so close in this closed ass room. And I was just sitting there thinking about what the fuck am I about to tell this nigga? <laughs> What am I about to tell this nigga that noise was? Because I, I swear I didn't want to tell him that it was the gun. I'm like, I'm just sitting there thinking, like, think, think, think. What, 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 what can you say? Like, now, he, he ain't come for a while. He, I was surprised at that, too. I, I thought he was going to come running out. But when he did finally come out, he was like, boy, what the hell you out here doing? I was like, dropping shit. I couldn't think of shit else. And he, and then he was just like, you dropped that gun? I was like, yeah. 
I couldn't do nothing but say it because there is no motherfucking way I could say I dropped anything that could be that loud in this room. On carpet? <laughs> I couldn't think of no lie for shit. You hear me? But uh, all in all, he was cool about everything. You know what I'm saying? He was just telling me, put the safety on, all that shit. I had to explain to him there is no safety on the motherfucker. And I, I still lied, though, you know what I'm saying? I still lied to him when I was dropping it. I, I dropped it, and it went off. It didn't, though, you know what I'm saying? I dropped my motherfucker all the time, and it don't go off. But, man, I, I just went to share that with y'all. That's, like, a really embarrassing fucking moment. And it's very true. And I just couldn't, I, I swear to God, I couldn't think of no lie to tell this nigga. Like, damn, I can't think of no motherfucking <laughs> I was trying my best to come up with one. Like, damn, what, what can I say? <laughs> I couldn't do shit. But accept it. It was a mistake, man. You got to accept your mistakes, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, either change them, work them out, or whatever the fuck you got to do. You know what I'm saying? To make the shit better. And I was, I was trying, but I couldn't do it, man. I should have just kept it real and told the truth. You know what I'm saying I was pointing my foot at the ground and clearing the, the like the head. You know what I'm saying? Hurt, I was gonna make sure that heard that click. That motherfucker said, "Wow!" I was like, "Oh, what am I gonna tell this nigga?" <laughs> I just wanted to share that shit with y'all, man. I, I I I do stupid shit sometimes, man. You know? I mean, we all do. You know what I'm saying? I own up to my shit. You know what I'm saying? I own up to my shit when I'm doing dumb shit or fucked up shit or whatever. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted to share this shit with y'all, man. Because y'all fucks with me and I fucks with you and we fucks with each other. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, yo, I'm out.